Red Hat Enterprise IPA is a new solution from Red Hat. There are three key questions that you need to ask and to have security. And they are, who are you? What can you do? And what have you done in the environment? And those are often referred to as authentication, authorization, and audit, or AAA. We've tweaked that and called it um, IPA, identity. So who are you? Policy, what can you do? And audit. Red Hat Enterprise IPA, um, it's a centralized identity management solution for Unix and Linux clients. A lot of the customers are asking for these centralized identity and policy solutions in order for them to meet requirements laid down by the regulatory compliance auditors. Um, one of the other requirements that these auditors are giving to customers is the ability to audit all of these decisions to make sure you're able to say not only do you know who the users logging in are, controlling what they're allowed to do, but also keep a record of what they did so that you can go back and check that in the future. Some compliance regulations, um, for instance PCI, would try to re restrict who can access a database of credit card information. HIPAA, same thing, who can access uh, healthcare records. And you might have an application that prevents you coming in the front door and just going and seeing that credit card data. But in IT, there's systems administrators who can get onto the boxes and access whatever's on there. And Red Hat Enterprise IPA will enable an organization to just say, these groups of administrators can access these groups of machines, or they can, and, and audit when they did. A lot of organizations today are trying to solve the problems that Red Hat Enterprise IPA solves. The organizations are solving it on their own, cobbling things together. Really what we've done is take a few of the core components and try and simplify things, make it easy for people to install the software, make it easy for people to maintain the software. Even though we're built on top of open standards like Kerberos, like LDAP, um, the administrators and the users of these systems don't have to know anything about the underlying technologies because we've provided scripts for the, to ease the installation, the maintenance, provided a simple user interface, so it's very easy to go in there, create users, manage users, um, ultimately to be able to manage those policies that affect those users. From the end user's perspective, say me logging in, IPA provides the benefit of single sign-on. So I can log into one system and once I authenticate myself, I don't need to retype my password as I go to different uh, parts of the environment. There's also great benefits in just in efficiency terms, in cost of ownership, so you don't have to go around managing a thousand different identity repositories on all of your different machines when it can all be done from one central location. So for an organization that understands and is in agreement with Red Hat's Linux automation vision, Red Hat Enterprise IPA fits right into that and helps to enable it.